Hey guys, in this video I'm going to talk to you all about selling stickers at a farmer's market, pop-up market, whatever type of market day, and being successful, promoting your business, and making it profitable for you. So stay tuned and see what I did and, and my strategy for this. So this is the market that I attended last, and this is only the second one that I've done so far. Um, the first one I did, uh, it didn't seem like it was an immediate success. It took about two weeks and I started getting calls from people. As you can see, these here are labels that I made for this person. They ordered, I, I don't know, several hundred of those. I think it was 500 of those. Several of these customers are already mine. Um, this lady here ordered all these labels for her bows for me. Um, this was from the first event that I went to. So as you can see already at the second event I went to, people are already using my product that they bought from me. So this is a, a relatively small market. I would say there's always between, I would think, like 35 and 45 vendors. I, it's not at all the biggest I've seen. All these labels on all this, uh, on all this bass bait, these are all my labels. Some of them, the ones without the pictures, the ones they already had before they got those from me. Those are some young entrepreneurs. They're like 14 or 15 years old, I think. And uh, anyway, so... The first one I went to, I tried to sell stickers for a dollar and two dollars a piece. That didn't really seem to work out. I sold some, but not very many. I also had my roll labels there, and I sold one roll. There's my booth right there. I had one. Uh, I sold one roll of roll labels that said "Thank you for shopping local," or maybe they said "Thank you for su supporting small business." And I sold one roll of that for $20 last time, and that was really the, the only sale that I made uh, that was a decent sale. Everything else was just a dollar here, a dollar there. But this time I, I gave away all the stickers for free. I had my full inventory of all the stickers that I'd normally have, and I gave them away for free. That banner back there, I made that one right there, the one that says grass-fed meat. A lot of this stuff I made for these people, and like I said, this was all from the first event that I went to, so I already made a lot of money after the event. They have a bunch of bags back there. They have my labels on those bags that are hanging on the trailer door back there. Um, you can't really see them very good in this video, but they're back there. Anyways, um, and then here's a time lapse. You can see everyone stopping by just grabbing free stickers. But my main thing was so that I can network with other people. The key thing is that everybody that is at this event is also a small business owner they need stickers and labels for their businesses and so these people like the guy right there this that's looking through my stickers he has a hot sauce company and makes hot sauce so he needs labels for his bottles i gave him some free die cast uh, or sorry die cut stickers and um, he placed an order within the first 30 minutes of me setting up and um so he placed an order for some die cut stickers because i made him some samples and he fell in love with them and then after that, um, you know, we talked about the labels and I took the initiative basically and told him the price and I could do on that. And it sounds like we'll end up striking a deal on that also. He's not moving a whole lot of product, but every new client that I can pick up is a success because as they grow, they'll end up spending more money with me. And um, so anyways... I said all those were for free the only thing I was selling was I have a row in the front of the table there that was uh, some roll labels those are the only things that I have for sale everything else was for free I had a bunch of samples on the table to the left as far as like they were they were stuck on a piece of plexiglass and stuck on a piece of star or uh, cardboard this showed off other stickers that I'd already made for companies and just to show kind of what I do and then all the tables on the other side there on the right of the, sc of the screen are ones that are actually, you know, for f people to take. They're just free stickers, just stacks of them. And um, so a bunch of people came by, and just the fact that they came by, it started conversations. Uh, the majority of people that actually stopped by were asking questions about services that I provide and how I could actually work with them and their businesses. So it seemed to be a real big success, and I'm sure I'll get lots of calls after the fact. So we just got to see how it's going to work out. I'll let you guys know later on in other videos, you know, how successful this particular event was. But I definitely did already get some orders from it. So it's already been paying off. Um, I said I got an $80 order within the first 30 minutes. The booth price was $40 for the booth. So 
I already made back my money plus some, so it was a success already. So thanks for watching, guys.